It's finally baseball season here at Founders Park as South Carolina hosts UNC Greensboro in opening weekend. The Gamecocks are hungry for more after falling just short in the Super Regionals last season. Junior pitcher Clark Schmidt reclaimed the Friday night starter spot after being dominant all of last year as the 2017 Road to Omaha is officially underway. Founders Park was sold out Friday night for the 49th time in park history and the crowd was as excited as ever. Clark Schmidt got things going by throwing a strike as the first pitch. TJ Hopkins kept the energy going with a leadoff double in the first. Alex Cicino played him with a single into the gap, scoring the first run of the season. UNC Greensboro pitcher Jack Maynard struggled keeping control as he threw three wild pitches that led to scoring Destino. The Gamecocks jump out to an early 2-0 lead. South Carolina bats got going again in the third when Cullen walked to load the bases with two outs. But Madison Stowe grounds out to end the inning and strands everyone. Schmidt gave up his second hit of the game in the fourth off a leadoff homer to Dylan Stewart to cut the Gamecocks' lead in half. But that wouldn't stop the Gamecocks. Williams got a leadoff walk in the bottom half of the inning, followed by a single by Jacob Olsen. Olsen moved into a scoring position as Danny Blair comes to bat, and Blair comes through with a single down the right field line to score Olsen. The scoring doesn't stop here as Hopkins doubles again, this time plating two with just one out in the inning. The party keeps going as Destino doubles to the same spot, bringing home Hopkins and giving South Carolina a comfortable 6-1 to one lead. Fast forward to the fifth, after Olsen gets plunged by a pitch, Williams moves into scoring position and he's later able to score off yet another wild pitch. It's now 7-1 Gamecocks. The Spartans look to make some progress, but Andrew Moritz grounds into a 5-4-3 double play. Beautiful defense right there by the Gamecocks, and they can't get anything going. Schmidt's day is done after six and two-third innings, giving up just one run on three hits, and he gets a huge ovation from his team and the crowd. Coley Bowers replaces him, and he delivers, sending down the first four batters he faced all on strikeouts. Down to their final out, Stewart looks to do something, but he grounds out, and that ends the game. South Carolina takes game one, 7-1, to one, and they get their opening night win. Here's what winning pitcher Clark Schmidt has to say about the game. To go out there and, and to get a win like that today is huge, especially for the weekend. It's, it sets a, a good tone for, for the rest of the weekend. And for me personally, I mean, it's an honor to go out there on opening day and be able to pitch. It's one of my goals, like I said, in off season to be able to come out here on opening day and get the start. So to be able to get the nod and come out with a win is very, I'm very blessed. Thanks to solid outings from both Schmidt and Bowers and an offensive spark in the fourth inning, the Gamecocks got off to the start they wanted. Outfielder TJ Hopkins went 3 for 4 in the game with two doubles and two RBIs. The Gamecocks look to continue this hot start as they prepare for game two of the series. For Capital City Sports, I'm Claudia Chikamian.